my channel or if you're new here please subscribe so in today's video I have my iPhone 7 plus and I'm gonna show you what's on it and I previously did this video back in February 2018 but I didn't film it with me in front of the camera talking because unfortunately my old red can of camera broke when I was filming outside a strong wind blew it, it was on the tripod and it fell straight into the cement while the lens was open. Oh, that was a gruesome day. And by the way, this is an updated What's on my iPhone 7 Plus, so I hope you guys enjoyed this update since it's 2019, so yeah, what the heck. So I haven't used this phone case in a while. It's my most favorite phone case out of all my phone cases is, is a Windex phone case. I just like it. I don't know why it's my favorite. It's just cute and unique and just oh so random. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to like, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel. Really mean a lot to me. Give this video so many likes and let's reach up to 1.5k subscribers. And without further ado, let's get started. Alright guys, let's get started. So the first thing I want to show you guys is my wallpaper screen. It, it is a background from the 1990s Sailor Moon anime. It's so aesthetic. It has all the bokeh effects. It is the night sky. And it is in the Tokyo with the Tokyo Tower and the buildings. And I absolutely love Sailor Moon. I am a huge Sailor Moon fan. And I was even Sailor Moon for Halloween. Anyway, I'm going to show you guys what's on my iPhone. So we obviously have settings, mail, camera, photo albums, and my notes. So the first album that I have are my backdrops, which I use for my Instagram stories. Follow me on my Instagram, Bianca Moonstone 98 So this one is like an aesthetic pastel planet from the new anime this year, Twinkle Star Pretty Cure. It's about astrology. Here's one that has hearts and bokehs on it. I'm gonna, I'm sorry it's a little blurry and not good quality. And obviously I showed you my Sailor Moon one and on the on the bottom you can see a Sailor Starfighter, Sailor Mars, and Eternal Sailor Moon. And they're looking up at the Tokyo Tower. And there's the moon, I just noticed that. And then under my backdrop I have a Bianca album, which is an album dedicated to me. And here's a picture, here's a recent picture of me at college with my new lunch bag I got for Christmas and a new jacket. And here's me when it was raining. So this album that is named Bianca are all photos of me. And I and my first photo was from Christmas last year. I mean Christmas 20 Christmas 2017. And then here's me in my night to remember on May 18th. This was my dress. I was wearing a light pink dress and all night everyone said I looked beautiful. And then here's my birthday cake. A video of me, a video of me where everyone is singing happy birthday, my VidCon pictures. Alright, now that we've seen my Bianca album, I'm going to show you my next album. By the way, I alphabetize all my photo albums if you're wondering because I like being organized and I am an organized person. So my next album are my design ideas where these are ideas that I want to draw. So here's one of Sailor Moon. Oh, I just love Sailor Moon. And here is one. I'm going to recreate myself wearing this outfit. I am not copying the girl. I'm obviously going to do me with dark hair and I'm going to change the outfit to pink, not purple. And then I'm going to draw myself as this girl looking at a food magazine because I love food. Here is a girl named Kirara wearing a star dress. And I'm going to draw myself with my friend trying on clothes, like we're shopping. Oh, I do this one today that I'm eating food. I'm drawing myself eating the cake while there's food that I like surrounded by me. Here's a girl shopping, and by the way, I love shopping. And then I'm, and I'm going to draw this for Valentine's Day. This is a possible Valentine's Day speed paint inspiration. Now that I've shown you my design ideas, I'm going to show you my drawings. And yes, I love drawing and I obviously I make a album for all my drawings so I can remember. I like taking before and after pictures. Here is me writing in a diary in pencil. I mean it looks so cute. 
And by the way, there's me with a pen. I created this pen. I really don't have it in real life. And the journal is my Dreams and Thoughts YouTube journal that I have. Here's a girl named Homari from Hakuto Perikyo. And then here's the mythical fairy I created. She has a nice off the shoulder top with a butterfly brooch. Same with a butterfly, butterfly belt. Uh, two, two ruffled denim skirts and some hot pink boots. And I'm very happy how I drew her fairy wings. And then I drew this on December 30th, 2018. It's sort of like a New Year's picture. I'm like, hi guys. And then this is my strawberry festival contest entry. I call it Strawberry Utopia and it's basically a girl laying down on a strawberry and strawberry fields are behind her. Here's the original version. Here's a sketch of my December 30th drawing, the orange one I showed you. Pencil and inking. Here is the inked version. Maybe I should make a coloring book. My next album is, if you guys seen this, if you guys seen this, I made this into a vlog. I went to Funbox with my best friend in Thousand Oaks. I'll put the link down below or I'll put up the iCard if you're interested in watching it. So here's my Funbox photo album. I had a fun time. I took so many pictures like this Angel Wings, a full version. Okay, that's not a good picture. Here's one of me with the wall of piggy banks, a huge piggy bank. Oh my gosh, I miss Funbox so much. So much, it was so much fun. And here's me in front of an 8-bit Wonder Woman, if you guys can tell if it's Wonder Woman. Supergirl! My next folder is my Lucia Nanami folder. By the way, this is going to be a possible Halloween costume. I'm going to be her for Halloween. She is one of my favorite anime magical girl characters. Oh, I just love her. And I really want to be a mermaid for Halloween. Here's my celebrity crush, Ross Lynch. This is a photo album dedicated to him. Oh, look at how he's biting his sunglasses. Here's him, oh, those huge hands. And this is a recent picture from today. He met a fan, but he was walking his dog, Vader. Or was it Velvet? And he's just such a sweet person and I would love to meet him again. I met him two times, by the way. Oh, I smile. Uh, that ass, though. <laughs> and I got this sweater, says Creator. I still have it. It's oh so warm. I met YouTubers like Adeline Morin. My best friend Allie loves her so much. She absolutely adores her as much as she adores Ariana Grande. So Adeline and Ariana Grande are her, are her top idols. Adeline was so cute. I also met Mason. He's an Instagram star. If you guys don't know who Mason is, he is a friend of Brent Rivera. I also met the Stoke twins. They were cute. And you guys are going to have your mind blown once you see this. I asked them if they could take a picture of me of kissing me on the cheek. And I was like, they're like angels. <laughs> oh my gosh, I didn't notice this picture. He was like, she's cute. Now that I showed you my VidCon fold folder, I'm going to show you what's on my notes. But I'm going to show you the YouTube one because most of them are like personal business college stuff. So on my YouTube notes, I have my 2019 schedule. It's not official, but I already planned my Halloween one, which is October. I'm mostly doing Halloween DIYs. Here's my summer one. And I already confirmed January. January is not on there because I already wrote it on my calendar. So the confirmed months that I got the videos all done are February and March, which I'm so excited. And I'm still posting every Friday. <sighs> Making YouTube videos are so much fun. And this is an upcoming video called 50 Facts About Me. Right now, I am at, oh, I got a notification. I'm at fact 41, which is my favorite fruits are strawberries, bananas, and grapes. So look forward to that. That will come out next week, hopefully. And then I obviously have my iTunes. I have Apple Music. I've been recently liking this song called 
Monochrome Kiss from Black Butler by Amy Lee. Amy Lee, she's like an, an amazing singer. She does anime song covers in English. I just really like Monochrome Kiss. It's such a beautiful song and she has a beautiful voice. And my apps, I don't have that much apps like games. So I have Bitemoji, Pinterest, Gmail, Instagram, obviously YouTube because I eat, sleep, and drink YouTube 24 seven. I also have a fine iPhone, a Joann's one, and a YouTube studio. The end. Well, that is it for this What's on My iPhone video. Don't forget to like, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel. Really mean a lot to me. Give this video so many likes. Once again, let's reach out to 1.5K subscribers. And by the way, see ya!